So, Emery, um, you're arachnophobic, right? Yes, I am. Did that influence your decision to become a scientist at all? <laughs> well, I have to deal with spiders on a daily basis in my okay. field, of course. You know, in the lab, they have spiders. <laughs> but it's an entire planting. term. Is that true? Yeah, an, enti- an entire year, actually. My whole second year was spent studying spiderology. That must have been hell. Could you, could you, could you tell us more about that, please? <laughs> <laughs> it's about having the strength of will and dedication and love of the sport. That's mm. what it's about. That's, I understand. The thing is, what I've heard and what, and what I read in the tabloids, actually, is uh, you... <laughs> the biochemistry tabloids. <laughs> you, you were once married to a spider, is that correct? You know, why are you bring up ancient history? No, man? hey, that I'm just 20 years ago. Mate, I'm just, I'm <laughs> saying, sorry, I'm, sorry. I'm saying people are talking about it and our, our, listeners, you know, you're, our listeners are interested. And, you know, people um, say you're a nice guy and you come, hey, you I'm, come out like I'm this. Just, I'm just a journalist. Imagine man. just, a, <laughs> imagine just a, like an Embry Aragog hybrid just walking <laughs> around the streets of London. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that would be, that would be extraordinary. <laughs> So what now is, you're referencing trauma, you know. How, you know Aragog was the reason I'm afraid of spiders. So Emre, if anyone doesn't know, <clears throat> yeah, he uh, he watched the Chamber of Secrets, which is his primary primary sources. I think you'll agree, right? Uh, yeah, um, yeah. I mentioned it in my interview for sure. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And um, well, big old spider freaked him out, and you've never really recovered. Which uh, was no, was I, a form uh, of trauma. I it makes a lot of sense. I didn't recover. <laughs> it was weird. I I watched the film and I was quite ill that night for whatever reason, mm-hmm. and I had a fever dream where there were just spiders everywhere in my room. It was no fun. That sounds pretty horrifying. Yeah, no was. I mean, no wonder you would be terrified of it. I mean, it does make for quite a lot of fun, to be fair. No. <laughs> my, 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 my house, spiders, for example, is... Or... Yeah, there, you can find spiders in the corners, and it does make for a lot of fun when you've got Emery around. As we found out the other day. <laughs> yeah, my siblings found that out early as well, unfortunately. <laughs> you must have a very, very traumatic childhood. <laughs> <laughs> you know, us spider-phobes. <laughs> <laughs> we prefer the term spider-phobes. <laughs> yes, I do, I do. Um, you've been bitten by one before, right? We are preyed on. It is actually, it, it's horrible. In the food chain, you are below. <laughs> it's, it's human. We are below the spiders that we fear. When a spider, when a spider comes up to you, do you sort of like make yourself big? Yeah, I think yeah, so. It's sort of terrifying. I will say, what are the tactics? It's yeah. a common misconception that spiders are more afraid of us than we are of them. We are definitely more afraid of them. Spiders have no fear. They feast on the blood of other animals. <laughs> that is true. 